up everybody well, I'm pretty excited about today here it is uh, Sunday uh, second week in October the temperature started to come down right right now it's uh, my car is saying it's 61 degrees out kind of windy I'm not sure what the barometer is saying but I'm sure it's it's uh, up there pretty good I'm off to the bass hole and so what I plan on doing is to uh, try to get to this lake that's on the east side of the highway that I pass by every time I go to the bass hole. It looks big and it looks promising. I just have to find a way to get down to it. And I'm also going to go, to, the, as I said, to the bass hole. I'm hoping to, uh, to hook an, another big one or maybe more than one big one. Um, and I'm also going to try to collect up some, some bluegill. And then uh, I would like to try to find this other lake, the uh, retention pond that I passed one time when I was going over to Thunderbolt Park. Uh, so I'm going to try to, to make my way to there if I can. Regardless, it's still uh, mid-morning, so I should have a, a nice long day of fishing. My only uh, curiosity, I guess you could say, is being in the low 60s, how cold is the water going to be? Hopefully it's not too bad, but uh, we'll make do with what we've got. I'm going to stop there at Polly's Island Outdoors and pick up some night crawlers because I'm planning on using artificial and night crawlers. But uh, come on with me, let's uh, see what we can scare up today, see if we can conjure up some big, big bass. Well, this little retention pond, as I was leaving the big lake, looks pretty promising. Okay, fish on. Ah. Okay, I know there's fish in here. Looked like it might have been a warm mouth. Fish on. Come up here, Mr. Crappie. Okay, Bobby Garland, do your thing. Little one tried to take it just now. Okay, fish on another one there we go look at that two crappie in a row there we go Okay, fish on. Come up here. Slow down, Mr. Bass. There we go. This black and uh, and yellow Bobby Garland's doing really good right here. Oh. 
Okay, fish on. <clears throat> Come here, Mr. Bass. Not a monster, but you will do. There we go. He got away. Well, I'll just have to catch two more to make up for him. Well, here we are, back to the bass hole. That little pond next to the, I think it's the nursing home, turned out to be a really good stop. So, I think you'll enjoy that that footage. I was surprised at at the uh, crappie in there. Okay, fish on. There we go. A little bass. They got that. I thought he hit it good. Look at that little thing. I was beginning to think I was going to come to the bass hole and not get anything. I'm glad he proved me wrong. Okay, fish on. There we go. About time. Come here, big old, big old red ear. He's barely hooked too. Look at that. Okay, fish on. Well, he gave me a time. There we go got too much stuff balancing around here Fish on! Yeah, there we go. Well, that one got right up under me. Hold on there, you. There we go. Pretty bluegill. on if I can there we go come here well, this side is got some real nice bluegill in it Boy, 
I'll tell you what, I am just all tangled up. Well, shoot. I guess I'm just gonna have to catch two to replace him. Let's get back in this corner and see if we can get some more on this night crawler. This seems like a good spot for it. fish on you get a good a better hook set on this one definitely gonna have to be careful getting him back in the basket he done got himself really hooked Open wide. Yeah, I'll we'll just give him a, give him this hook. fish on it's a little one a little one but that's that's two it makes up for the one that I lost Need to hurry up though because sunset is coming fast. Although bass do bite in the dark. Look at that. I got one right on. Right under me. Oh. I didn't even cast it. Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Don't you go anywhere. Mr. Bluegill, you just hang on. I think there was another trying to bite it just then. They could at least do me the courtesy of putting my line out. Yep, right there. Look at that. Whoa, whoa, hold on. Get in the basket. Oh, come on. Don't make me catch two more. I think I got one on there. I do. Look at that. I think maybe I need to... I 
get everything settled before I put my line back out. I've got a feeling there's going to be something over there. Yep. There. Oh, that's a good one. I think we've got a bass. Yes, we do. There we go. Thought there might be something up in that cover. There's one. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Settle down. You're going in the basket. Look at you. Got a little fight in you. Yeah, we're getting a nice little basket of fish. At this rate, I might as well just leave the Leave the lid to the night crawlers open. There we go. Oh, oh, come here. Well, that's a good one. That is a big old bluegill. A slab bluegill. Look at that, big as my hand. He doesn't swallow that hook. I might as well give him the hook. I think getting that hook out would do more damage than anything. Look at that thing. That is nice. Yeah, hey, he is a slab. Here we go, fish on. Thought there might be something on there, under that, under those bushes. And there was. Another one. Ah. I hate it when that happens. There we go. I'll make up for it. Come on, be still. Well, he's got that hook too. So I'm just gonna call it a night for the worms because it's getting too too dark for me to be tying hooks that I don't really have that many hooks left. Oh, that's a nice one. 